What is up guys? I'm back with another video and today I'm back in Indiana and I'm with my mom. Yay! Mama Dupes. So guys, uh, I've done this. If you guys are looking at the ingredients, I've done this before. Well, for one, I haven't done a cooking video in forever. But today, today I'm doing it. Tonight, I'm doing it with my mom. And this is the peanut butter cornflake thing. So, okay, so she does, she makes all these treats for the holidays, you know, for Christmas, Christmas Eve, tomorrow. So she's making the peanut butter cornflakes. So I thought it would be cool if you saw it from her point of view cooking it, <laughs> other than mine, you know, with the metal bowl, as you guys, you know, remember very good. But my mom's going to be cooking it, and I'm going, I'm going to be her, like her sous chef. Like, I'm just going to pretty much just be like, okay, you want these dumped in this bowl? Okay, I'll dump it. But yeah. So we're gonna make peanut butter cornflakes part two with Mama Dukes. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. Let's just try to get it to, I don't know, 2,000 two likes. I think we can do that. But uh, we're gonna get into this video. Hope you guys enjoy it and uh, as much as we do in this video. So um, let's get it, guys. All right, guys. The first step is we're gonna put some peanut butter in a bowl. Don't measure. I don't measure anything. So we're just gonna put a couple scoops, a few scoops. As I say, couples too. This is a few. <laughs> a few. And we're gonna open. Get some scissors, sorry. As I say, need assistance, Jacob. Scissors. <laughs> scissors. Now pour the bag of butterscotch. More cells. There we go. Whole bag. And then we're just <laughs> going to put it in the microwave for probably about three minutes, but keep checking. Okay, so it's totally different. So when I started, if uh, you watched it, Mom, I think you did. I, did, I put uh, just a little bit, and then I put, well, because I was making for like a, a little bit of people, like three or four. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I didn't put that much, but she is, so it's going to be a lot of treats. So, uh, you ready for this? Here it goes. All right. So put it in the microwave. So I got that step first. I got that step right. I got Plastic. that step first. Yeah, plastic. Don't use metal bowls, right, Mom? Right. No right. metal in the microwave. None. And see, I didn't... Okay, so actually, I'm not going to lie. I I actually recently just put a metal bowl back in the microwave um, when I was at at the house in Houston. So um, I put it in there, and it starts making a shock thing. I go, I did this before. <laughs> so you're not supposed to do this. So I heard you switch the bowls and everything, okay? <laughs> But yeah, I, I didn't really learn from my mistakes, but I did now. So uh, we're waiting for the peanut butter and the butterscotch to melt, I'm pretty sure. And uh, what's the next step's gonna be? The next step is we're just gonna pour some cornflakes in the bowl and just start stirring. So we wait So we wait for this. Yep. So we wait for it to get all melted. And uh, we're gonna see if the peanut butter looks the same melted as it did when I did it. So, um, so yeah, it's good. you can, if you like more butterscotch, add more butterscotch. If you like more peanut butter taste, add more peanut butter. So I, th I said that. You. I said that. It's up to your flavor that you like. So. And our flavor, I think, is we like more peanut butter, Yay! right? Right. More peanut butter. More peanut butter. You like more peanut butter? Yeah. <laughs> I do. All right. Peanut butter. peanut butter is way better than butterscotch, in my opinion, and uh, probably a lot of people's opinions. But uh. Just like people have an opinion on my haircut, you know, I think it looks horrible, but they think it looks alright. But we like peanut butter. Who knows? But yeah, we love peanut butter. We love peanut butter, and uh, whatever's left over on the spoons, we eat it. So uh, <laughs> yeah, so we're waiting for this peanut butter to get melted. It's almost done. Uh, we're about got a minute twenty. You probably you you probably about to stir it in I'm between. I'm gonna stir it now. Okay. Yeah. All right. Because you don't want your peanut butter to um, cook. You just want it melted. Ooh, so then you just wonderful. start stirring and the, um, the butterscotch will melt. So you just want to keep stirring it up. And then do you, do you keep going until like those clumps are gone? Correct. Yeah, keep stirring See, it See, they wouldn't it go melts. away. They wouldn't go away when I was It wasn't cooking. hot enough then. They need I to was, melt. It was in there for a while. But you don't want to leave the peanut butter too long in the microwave because it'll um, start cooking and then it'll, it'll get hard and it's nasty so you just want it to where it's drippy okay so we're gonna put it in for a few more minutes so mine didn't look like that but uh, that's what it's really supposed to look like so yeah. if you guys watched the part one video 
Watch the part two, because that's the real. That's the real. So if you real want recipe. This. And then I'm actually going to get my pan, which I should have been prepared more, a little bit better. Right, Patsy? Patsy! Ready? Real sous chefs right here. Then I just get a couple of pans. And we're just going to put an aluminum foil on top of them. Sorry. <laughs> Do your thing, lady. We just chilling in the thing. Okay, I'm just gonna lay it on top because once it is completely done, we just stick it in the refrigerator so it gets hard. Yeah, I didn't do this. I just stuck the whole entire bowl in the refrigerator on mine. You can do that. And you can eat it from there, however you. That's what I did. Want to eat it? But That's I'm gonna exactly be putting it for Christmas treats, so. Oh, so it's gonna be a little snack. Yes. Because huh. everybody loves these, and you can't just eat one. Right. It's like Doritos. Doritos? That's what I like. Okay, okay. Ooh, we're right up. So I was like the, I was like the knockoff version, like the great value version of this, uh, <laughs> these steps. The Walmart version, but everybody stops at Walmart. That's like okay. the That's real version. Walmart. Well, it is. So there you just keep stirring until those little bumps are gone. So you wait till every single one's gone? No. Because I did not. I, I had no patience. No, not every single one. Yeah, butter looks nice though. Yeah. Okay, now. <laughs> got the lovely Christmas shopping. I got me a couple shirts and a sweatshirt today. Yep. My mom fainted. Hold up. My mom fainted and I didn't know it, but that's all I'm going to say. That's, that was crazy. She fainted and fell on her butt and she claimed she has a big bruise on it now. But yeah, that was crazy. Luckily, stepdad Drew was there and uh, saved mom's life. Wish I could record it, but I wasn't there at the time. At a 44 so. years old, first time I've ever fainted. Crazy. Crazy. Okay. But yeah, so. next step. Next step, I got another bowl, bigger bowl, mm -hmm. and I'm going to pour some cornflakes in there. As many as you want? Um, about half of this box. I got the really big box. So half of the big box you pour? Yeah, just to start. Just to start? Yeah. So you're going to be you, making more? You make them. Oh, okay, okay. I got you. As thick as you want. All right. So I just pour hey, it Jordan. on there. Just pour a little bit, and there's still some clumps, but it'll, it'll melt It'll clump out. Yeah. And then you just take your spoon and stir. Stir up. Stir up. So, and it's not too much, so we need to add a little bit more. So you judge on how much peanut butter you want in your cornflakes. Yep. How how um how much stuff I want on it. So you make it as thick as you want or Thick. But you want to get all the cornflakes some peanut yep. butter. You want you know, sharing is caring in this. Yes. And a lot goes a long way. A lot a goes a long way. way. Yeah. Oh. What was that? Chocolate? Okay. Uh huh. And then people want to <laughs> throw the almonds. I don't want you to eat them. All right. <laughs> The ghost. Okay. I don't know who did that. <laughs> okay, so then when we're done, it looks like that. Right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna just pour it on the pan. No special neat way, just pour it. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. And then let's say, why were you not making little treats? But yep. okay, you gotta wait till it's hardy. Yep, you spread it out in a thin, <clears throat> thin layer. You know. Thin layer. Is this all you're making or you're making another pan? No, I'm making more. Okay, it's more. I'll probably have about three pans total. Three pans. I'm not going to show all these pans. Just, you know, just the, just yeah. the first pan probably. So it's about even like that. Okay. What's that? That's somebody's pizza. Alright, someone's pizza. making pizza. <laughs> That's mine. You just continue to do that so I'll throw some more in here. So it's quick, two easy, really steps. But this is the right way to do it. <laughs> 
I think I had more than one step. Where are you going with that? Mm. She's eating cereal with my cornflakes. With no sugar. That's disgusting. <laughs> no sugar? You're missing out. So you just do the same thing. So you just repeat the steps. Repeat the steps. Repeat it. Two easy steps. And you guys two. should make it for the holidays. Uh, cause, and plus it's a secret recipe. <laughs> we didn't show you what else we put in there secretly. Right. Can't show them that. That's I why I put secret recipe in the first video. Thought I was playing, but there actually is. And you can make as much as you want and use as little as you want, but I always get two bags of the butterscotch. Just in case. And I always usually have two things of the the peanut butter, but I usually probably only use one, but I make sure I use all of it because we love peanut butter. Just in case. Yep, and I oh always get two boxes of the cornflakes just in case I have so much of the peanut butter. But then Liberty can get some. Yeah, you and they love treats. it. They love peanut butter. Ooh, that's yeah. a good idea. Dog treats. Yep. Yeah. But yeah, guys, that was that was basically it. I mean, that's how you make the real peanut butter cornflakes. You know, I did the knockoff version, the great value version from Walmart. So, uh, and this is like the, what would you call this? Like the Costco version? No, this is like, like CVS versus Walgreens. Like obviously CVS, CVS. is way better. Okay, yeah, yeah you're, you guys have your opinions, but we're a CVS gang out here. But guys, here's the finishing thing. Well, not the finishing thing, but this is, the finishing product before it goes in the refrigerator. Yes, so now I'm going to put this in the refrigerator and then once it, um, so it can get cold, once it gets cold then I break it apart and put it in a, a Christmas bowl and then you can just eat it. So now it's going in the refrigerator. Bing! Ah. Ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video of uh, my mom cooking part two with peanut butter cornflakes. Um, anything to say? Just enjoy. It's easy, it's quick, and it's very, very good. So I don't think anybody will be disappointed if you like butterscotch and peanut butter. Yum. So, guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys want me and my mom to cook more things while I'm here today. And if you want Jacob to surprise guests and do some things Yay. too, you know, I like—I know you guys like my brother a little bit, you know, a little, <laughs> you know, according to the comments, you know. <laughs> Especially when <laughs> I take my glasses off. Yeah, when he takes his glasses off, you saw that one. Ooh, Ooh wow. Ooh. But guys, hope you guys enjoyed that video. You know, like, comment, and subscribe. Of course, give this video a thumbs up. Uh, we are out this thing. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Peace. Thank you.